Hey guys, and so today, um, we are looking at bugs and stuff, and sorry, I don't know what happened to the end. There we go. Lot better. So, before we look at the main subject of this video, here's an inchworm, and he is so cute. I mean, is he cute? I mean, I'll get him here. I can try and grab him off the tree. And he's one I just found. And here he is. I don't think he's doing too well. But. Anyway, I'm going to put him back on the tree. It's heavy. Whoa! There he is. Oh, right in between my toes. And he's going back on the tree. And there he is. Going up the tree. Now let's get to the main subject of the video. And since this camera can't pause, that's okay. Because, sorry, I'm just wiping off the lens again it got a little messy there um yeah so yeah we're definitely using the waterproof camera for a lot more stuff now um yeah so anyway here we are at mysterious green the mysterious green clump and i really don't know what this is but it's cool whatever it is and we found a grasshopper and it wants in fact there's stink bug or whatever that is right in there and that clip is just me turning the camera back on sometimes the screen turns there it is right there and you're actually farther you're actually a lot closer to the thing being featured than it looks you're a lot closer so Anyway, the thing being featured, I don't know why there's a tree in our garden box, but this is the thing being featured. This little beetle right here. And the reason why it's being featured is because there's 13 others on this whole, on this one side of the tree. Thir 14 beetles on one side of the tree. See? One, two, three, Four, five, that's two of them right there. Oh, and ants too. Six, seven, eight, nine. By the way, what's going what's going on there? I really don't know. So we're at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Oh, okay. And there might have been 15. What is that? Is that a caterpillar? Whoa. I think that's a caterpillar. That thing is weird and just spiky, and I don't want to touch it because it looks extremely poisonous. So <laughs> I'm not going to get that. I mean, I could, like, pull the branch down, but then it would probably fall on my face, and I really don't want that to happen. Probably you guys don't either. <laughs> don't want videos without me. <laughs> so, yeah. Just why I'm not gonna risk that thing. And back here, we have the woods. And what we're gonna do is go through here and one. One time we're going to take a video back here, but before you get all excited about that, just a second, before you get all excited about that, look how many plants and how grown up it is back there, you see? Isn't that just like wild, like, wild, wild, like crazy? 
there are so many plants back there you cannot move. So that's why we're gonna have to go in. It's really cold, like all bundled up in our coats and we're gonna have to go in extremely just bundled up like but we could get one in the snow if we could do that that would be cool yeah me and katie actually went back there one time in the snow it was so cool and i think i heard a walnut fall somewhere but i think it would have been much louder though. anyway here's the target while we were somewhere i can't remember where we were Oh no, I was at my grandparents' house. And um, well, when I came back. Oh, look, Granddaddy Longlegs. Whoop, whoop, come here. Or some people call them Daddy Longlegs. Oh, there's two. Big one and a tiny one. It's the big one. So I came, I come back. Like, I leave, and the target's fine. Except for holes in it. Come back, and I see this. And I'm like, what the heck happened? So, I'm thinking something came up here. Like, I'm wondering if it was something that wanted to eat the ants that live in here. Because if there was an ant colony in here, or was an ant colony in here, don't know which. Um, anyway, I think something came from back here to eat the ants in here, had to rip it open to get in there. Like maybe, yeah, probably not a raccoon. I don't know what would want to eat those. Okay, I'm gonna get a stick and get that spider web out there. Oh, that was the wimpiest stick ever. Whoa! <laughs> Did you see that? Did you see that? was insane. I mean, I don't even believe that just happened. I mean, look at this, like, you can already see um, the eggs and stuff right there, and there's already ants running around. And they're just going all over the place. Oh, and a snail, so. Yeah, a little snail. So we can put him in the shade. So you can see him right there. Wow. I'm going to do that again. Whoa. Look at all those tunnels. Okay, I don't want to get bitten by those ants. That would hurt. I mean... I got bit by a sugar ant once. I was screaming and flailing. Of course, I was only like seven. And that was three years ago. But it was between my fingers. So I was going, it hurt really bad. So anyway, that was amazing, wasn't it? I mean, I did not expect that at all. Just, I'm like, no ants on top, there usually are. Well, I bet the ant colony's gone. <laughs> oh, that was so funny. Oh, I just went, Argh! I was literally like, oh. I literally threw the handle and jumped. I went, Argh! That was so funny. You know what? You can actually get a better picture of me doing that. Here we go. I'm gonna get a good shot of me doing that. So here's what I did, guys. <laughs> so funny. Oh man. Did you guys think that was funny? I think I know I did. Hey, sorry. It's really bright because of the sun. I mean, yeah. And yeah. So. Yeah, and I think I might have 
told you this before, maybe, but my friend Jonathan from school also has a YouTube channel, and he asked me to please give a shout out to his channel. So shout out to the Penguins Video Gamer. So that would be V A, no spaces and no capital letters. So that would be V A P E. Yeah, I think there's no spaces. Just look it up. V A P E N G U I N S, and then Video Gamer, and that's his channel. He does Fortnite videos. So yeah. Um, yeah, just shout out to him. Yeah, Jonathan, I can't wait to get back to school and see him. Also, my other friends, too. But just wanted to give a shout out to Jonathan's channel. So, there you have it. That's our video for today, I think. We can see quick that inchworm is still there. And yes, indeed, he is. Isn't he so cute? I mean, look at him. He's just so cute. I'm trying to get a couple of different shots in. And then, just <laughs> Dang, I actually hit him. <laughs> Sorry, little guy. And this camera is actually fish eye, so everything's smaller, but you can get a bigger perspective. Let's see more stuff. I think something just bit me. Maybe I just felt prick right there. And also, this is not our whole video because I've got something else really cool to show you that my dad found. So it's in Charlotte's water table in this little ship. And boy, there it is. And it's not a creature. Well, it is. But it's a chrysalis, okay? A silver chrysalis with copper spots and everything and like spikes. It's so cool. We're going to get it in some kind of container and watch it and check on it sometimes and uh, make it a habitat and see what comes out. Like, if you guys know what's going to come out of that, comment below. So, anyway, bye guys. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and the Penguins Video Gamer. And bye. Thank you for watching. We'll see you later.